Now we all know the famous quote, what happens if we invest in developing our people and they leave us? What happens if we don't and they stay? But that's not the reason you as a leader or manager should be investing in your employees. Now let's debunk this nonsense and see how else we can look at it. As a leader and manager, you train your staff so they are able to do their job. So Richard Branson, no. You train people so they can stay at the same level and perform there. And once they are performed really well in their current job, then you can start having the conversation about developing them to another role or a role above the current role. So the question is, what happens when somebody is being developed to the next role or, the, or another role? It is very likely that the person will be leaving you leaving you to another department, to another organization, or even just out of your scope. There is the job managers and leaders. So do not fall for this. And most importantly, do not develop and train people with the intention of retaining them. Because do you know what it makes you? A career blocker. Yes, that is what it is. I have known managers and leaders that they are not developing their employees. They are just training them for the current role, making sure that they are really good at their job because they don't want to lose them. Why? Because they can't be bothered of training a new person. So yeah, you as a manager and leader, your job is to train your people and then develop them so they can move on with their lives and with their career. You cannot have this mentality of keeping and retaining people because that's just not what the job is about. Don't be a career blocker because it might serve you, your selfish interest as a leader or a manager, but it doesn't serve the individuals and it certainly doesn't serve the organization because the talent flow is blocked. There will be no fresh talent coming into the organization, no new ideas and no innovation. You are single-handedly killing the organization with the retention mindset. And as for the last part of this quote, treat them well enough so they don't want to leave. Is this why we treat people well? So they don't leave us? <laughs>